This right here, this is key. This is guns off the street. Making a difference, Genesee County Sheriff Chris Swanson touting the results of Operation Arrowhead. The program is designed to make downtown Flint safer. The sheriff tells TV5's James Belton why recovering all those guns is no coincidence. This has been an incredible task. Genesee County Sheriff Chris Swanson talking about the 115 illegal firearms recovered in what's called the Flint City Arrowhead District. Swanson says this effort is part of his commitment to reducing gun violence and enhancing public safety. Operation Arrowhead began in July 2022. It has six deputies and command staff. Operation Arrowhead is a partnership with local and state police and the Mott Foundation. These are guns that can be used to obviously commit a crime of some sort or actually even kill somebody. The guns that you see here are just a small sampling. And then two of these right here, these, these are Glocks. They have, uh, they have Glock switches on them to make them automatic. I tell you what, right now, we are, we are seeing these guns on, on so many different levels. Swanson went on to say that Operation Arrowhead has answered almost 13,000 911 calls, made nearly 5,000 arrests, and have performed thousands of business and neighborhood checks. Look at the numbers there. That's over 10,000 different businesses or neighborhoods that we just drove through, knocked on doors, went through businesses and said, are you okay? That's proactive. And when you have a police presence, especially as a business owner, when you have that interaction, we have that connection, and it's not just knocking on the door, it's here's my card, here's my number, here's my cell phone. How do we solve a problem? We're going to do that. Swanson tells us the second year of Operation Arrowhead has been more focused on downtown Flint. Downtowns and, and communities are the hub. And if you don't make it safe, then people won't come. Well, I'm proud to say that we made it safe. With the partnership and the collaboration we have, the stats show it. Sheriff Swanson tells us many of those illegal guns confiscated by Operation Arrowhead were taken from juveniles between 14 and 16 years old.